5 Things to Do in the First Few Weeks of Your Baby's Life Being a new parent is an exciting time. You're delighted by your baby's first coos and smiles, and eager to share the joy with others. But parents often miss the little things that will help them adjust and make it easier in the future. When your baby arrives, you might be overwhelmed at first by everything that needs to be done. Finish the video to learn the 5 things you should do in the first few weeks of your baby's life. Sleep when your baby sleeps Babies are built to sleep and wake up at different times from their parents. This is because babies' internal clocks are not synchronized with their parents' clocks. When a baby is a few weeks old, her internal clock is set to the time of day when she was born. So, if her parents are an hour ahead of their own time, a newborn is awake an hour before her parents are even awake. However, as your baby gets older, she will get used to her parents' schedule. Her internal clock will become synchronized with her parents' clock. Eat every two to three hours. The most important thing you can do for your baby is to make sure he or she is properly fed. There are a few reasons for this. Eat or drink at least every two to three hours. This ensures that your baby is not hungry between meals. Eat or drink the same amount at each meal. If you're breastfeeding, try to avoid eating or drinking between meals while your baby is breastfed. Eat or drink an appropriate amount of calories at each meal. If you're breastfeeding, make sure you're eating or drinking enough calories. Your baby needs calories to grow. Do not skip meals since it may make your baby hungry sooner. Let your baby mess you up. Holding and cuddling your little one is one of the best things you can do for him slash her. However, this doesn't mean you should stay in bed all day with your baby. Your baby's habits and reflexes are not fully formed yet, so you should let him slash her mess you up a little bit. This means that you should gently guide your baby's hands and body wherever he or she wants to go. This will teach your baby to control his slasher movements while strengthening your baby's muscles. This is also a good way to learn about your baby's likes and dislikes. Stay active When you're holding your baby, walk around the room while he or she's awake. This will help your baby get used to moving around while you're holding him slash her. If your baby is old enough, try walking around the house while holding your baby in a carrier or on your back. This is a great way to get some exercise and get your baby used to be carried. Be with your baby. Be sure to talk to your baby and interact with him slash her as much as you can. Talk to your baby whenever you have the chance. Playing with your baby will help strengthen your baby's muscles, stimulate his slash her brain, and help your baby become comfortable with being held and touched. Feed your baby when he or she is hungry. Try to avoid letting your baby wait too long between feedings. Overfeeding is just as harmful to your baby as underfeeding is. Thank you for watching. Feel free to check out the video description below for more information about this channel and this video. If you found this video and channel helpful in any way, please like the video. Subscribe to our channel, and leave a comment. 
Please tell us what type of videos you would like to see more of in the future.